So here's the challenge for today. We have this um, 3D sketch and we want to create a flattenable sheet metal um, region uh, with an open bottom. So where do we start? Well, let's go into the surfacing commands and use a bounded surface. And what we can do is we can quickly go around and um, pick each of these regions and um, build um, surfaces around all of, all of these items. And um, just what I'm doing is um, I'm just doing a right mouse click to accept. So any si anytime you see the um, tick sign up, up in the um, command finder um, you can just use a right mouse click to um, accept the input. Now the way that we're going to do this is we're going to use a um, uh, thin part to sheet metal or part to sheet metal. So um, what I just want to do is just go through and um, create a solid from this and um, because I've already got the sketches I thought the easiest way to do that would be just to um, put a face across each of those surfaces and then when I go to the um, stitch command uh, and just fence select that and accept it it tells me that the stitch surfaces form a solid body and um, <coughs> that's what we, we um, work from so under the uh, sorry, under the tools menu, we have a part sheet metal, and what this allows us to do is take this solid and um, create a sheet metal document from it. So let's uh, just move this over so we can see. We specified a one mil gap, um, but now we need to go through and pick the um, edges, which are going to form the bends. So how do we do this? We want to have just these three here. Notice as I um, select them it, it fills in the um, um, sort of the sheet metal faces for me so I can visually see. I've left this one open because you need to be able to um, flatten it so it can't be a closed shape. So the other ones that are going to be open are these ones. So we'll leave these open but we'll make these into bends and as I go round you'll see it as in those um, faces as well and um, just to change the material thickness to the inside I can click on the arrow and then right mouse click to accept it and that has done a conversion to a sheet metal leaving the bottom face open so that's the first stage then we want to go to flatten we can pick up on this face here and have that as the orientation and as you can see what we have is the um, flattened um, model.